one of the nicest hike. This is my 10-day itinerary starting at Hobart, the main city in Tasmania. Then we decided to go clockwise. I circle out all the major places where we are heading and staying for the night. The overall pace I will consider to be quite chill. The main purpose of this trip is to experience the van life. Activities we like to do are mostly sightseeing and doing the hiking trails. I'll be sharing all the places I visit, so sit back and enjoy this vlog.
Shay. Today's dinner we have instant noodle with abalone leftover from Chinese New Year, eggs and hot dogs. Anyway, I'm selling these thermal water bottles that's able to tell the temperature of the water inside once you touch the top of the lid. If you're interested, you can check out my store, uh, link in the video description.
today is the second last day of my Tasmania trip. Let me give you a quick tour of my camper van. Okay, the size of this van is suitable for two persons to sleep. Uh, stepping in the van, first of all, you can see there's a TV over here, uh, but I didn't switch on the TV at all. The seats over at the front can be turned 180 degrees so that they can watch the TV uh, this way. There's a seat over here, uh, there's a pull-up table. Okay, then um, there's a basin for you to wash your things, brush your teeth. There's a gas stove. Uh, there's also a microwave below, which can only be accessed when you have power on. Uh, same for the heater or air conditioner over here. So if you happen to be at an unpowered site uh, and the weather is very cold, then you cannot switch on this to warm yourself. Um, there is a fridge over here. Okay, the fridge, quite a lot of space inside. Then uh, here is a full size mirror. Okay, inside is the access to the bathroom, which you have your shower, small little basin, and this is your toilet bowl. Right, you can see all the top cabinets here. There's uh, uh, six of these cabinets, a lot of storage space, uh, definitely definitely enough for you to keep all your stuff. Then this is the bed, uh, surprisingly it's quite comfortable, very nice. Last day in Tasmania and returning the van data. Lots of first time happening in this trip for me. I did many road trips before, but first time on a camper van. Very, very different kind of experience, mixed feelings about it. I rank all the places I stayed in the video description below. You can DM me if you want to find out more. Also, my first time doing a vlog, totally not used to bring the Insta360 everywhere and recording every event down. First time flying a drone, which I borrowed from a friend. It's very fun, but when I set the tracking to follow my van, you will get the anxiety like not sure whether you will get lost. Oh, and first time taking business class, excellent service, feels like a boss. I'm doing this travel vlog just for fun, hope you enjoy watching it. See you back in Singapore.